Hey guys, sorry this video is up so late, but it's been kind of a wacky night. Um, <laughs> I'll tell you more about that in a minute, but um, I'm feeling a little under the weather today. <laughs> so, yeah, I like passed out when I got home from class. And then I was doing laundry, which I'm still doing. Um, but yeah, so my roommates decided that it would be funny to make fun of me. <laughs> for these videos starting today. So it all started when Jenna tweeted me and she was like, oh, watching your videos right now at work, ha ha ha, koi girl. Cause yesterday I was like talking about the koi necklace that I wear. Um, and I said that people were gonna start calling me koi girl. So I was right, they are. And joke's on her because she used the wrong koi. <laughs> I think she told, like, I don't think she used a real word because koi as in like, like shy or whatever is with a C, but she went K-O-Y. So I'm calling her out right now because that, I don't think that's even a word. Ha. So yeah, now I'm officially koi girl and um, it's cool. I mean, whatever. I was expecting it. But anyway, um, I'm done with classes for the week, which is always good. And it's especially good because I'm not feeling well and all I wanted to do today was sleep, but no, I had six hours of classes, um, which was really tough because I really, really almost fell asleep. Like, not physically, but mentally, I was definitely asleep <laughs> because I was hearing one thing and then not remembering it two seconds later. I, my mind was not processing anything, but... Um, I think I just need rest, and tomorrow is the day to do it. Pretty much my plans for tomorrow are to fold my laundry, do my nails, and go to the ballet at the Royal Opera House. Other than that, not too much going on. I might go to the drugstore and get, like, cough drops or something. I really want red lipstick, too. Really random, but I feel like it would go really well with some of the stuff I wear for, like, fancier occasions. I don't know. I've just always loved red lipstick and I don't have any. I have like a like a dark red lip gloss, but I want like bright red. Scandalous. Um I don't know what else there is to say. It's been kind of a boring week thus far. Um Megan, do you have anything to add? Oh yeah, we've been we've been reading Craigslist. I got to the end of the Denver ones. Oh, I just introduced Megan to Misconnections on Craigslist, so I feel Whatever. really bad because she's going to be reading it all the time now, and she's going to fail. She's going to flunk out of school. It's all my fault. <laughs> oh, yeah, also, um, I did something bad today because I've been trying to avoid buying soda. <laughs> this is payback for Megan because... I got her hooked on Craigslist, and she influenced me to buy soda today. <laughs> I'll, like, get it every once in a while at a restaurant or whatever, but today I bought, like, a two two-liter bottle. Um, had to do it, because when you're sick, you just need to feel comfortable, and I feel comfortable when I have soda, and then Dr. Pepper was looking really friendly and comforting, so I was like, yes. But I also got a small thing of orange juice, because... I don't know, they say that orange juice helps, but that's not what my nutrition professor told me last year. She said that is a myth, but you know what, Professor Short, I'm going to stick with it. <laughs> um, yeah, so I got that, and I also got a little like M&M ice cream cone thing, which wasn't that great, but it definitely hit the spot because I just needed like something cold on my throat. But... I think the soda is working because my throat doesn't really hurt that bad right now. It's just like a little irritating, but it's not horrible. Speaking of irritating, I was trying to Facebook chat with Kristen earlier and it was really delayed and she kept asking me the same thing, but for some reason it wasn't showing up on my page until like later. So I kept answering it, and I was like, why do you keep asking me the same thing? She was, like, asking me if I called our grandma yet, and I was like, no, I haven't because I've been talking to you. 
but she wasn't getting my responses. So then she kept asking it over and over again. I was like, no! So finally I just had to bring that conversation out into the public of the face place and leave it on her page. I was like, no, I haven't called Granny yet because I've been talking to you. But long story short, um, I did get in touch with Granny, so it was all good. I know you guys all love Granny and Kristen. I feel like you like Kristen more than you like me, which is really hurtful. But... <laughs> I'll live with it. And, um, again, speaking of Kristen, all these segues. Guys, don't worry about me studying Kristen for my psych project because it's totally, like, not a really invasive project. Like, I'm not going to be, like, picking at her love life or, like, anything like that. It's just, like, studying three different aspects of her personality and she can totally choose whatever we're going to study. I've already chosen the first one, but she can choose this, the second, too. Or the second and third. But, like, don't even worry because it's not going to be awkward. The first thing I'm studying is, like, why she's shy. <laughs> so just relax. It's not going to get awkward, you guys. Don't worry. Um, I know a lot of you were, like, freaking out about it, but it's going to be okay. I promise. And if it's not, she's allowed to withdraw. I told her that, and I wrote that in my ethics section. So it's going to be okay. Um, and other than that, I don't really have much to say. So until next time, much love.